What is up guys, this is Moritz here from Section Store once again and today I'm going to be showing you how you can get some of those animated stickers to your very own store. This is just an example of course, but it kind of gives you a feel of how you can use this section in your very own store. You have a bunch of different possibilities to animate those and I'm going to show you in a few easy steps how you can do this in your very own store as well. Let's get right into it. The first thing I did for it was that I headed on over to the Shopify app store where I did get the section store app and I headed on over to explore sections where you can find a very fine collection of all the sections we are offering right here. It's over 200 fully customizable Shopify exclusive components and you can get the app completely for free and even after installing one of the sections you can still delete the app and remain with the section itself so it's not going to slow your store down, it's going to be super fast and easy to install as well. Right, to actually get the section, we do charge a one time fee of $9. It means if you bought it once, you will also own it forever, and you're not going to need an expensive developer to custom code all this for you. And at the end of the day, you still have all the customization options in the world. And here's a little list of what the section actually offers like sticker colors, background, sticker positioning. You have all the options in the world to actually adjust that. And I'll just show you how you can get this one. So before actually being able to use it, you have to head back to the My Sections area of the app where you have to add it to the theme you're using. In my case, it is the Dawn Light theme, but it does work on every theme, so don't worry about that. Then simply click on Customize and open up the theme editor. So here we are in the theme editor, and now I want to put one of my icons I have right in here to just create a little bit more of attention to this whole thing. And this is also one section I also used it. So this is this one animated stickers already and you can edit as many times as you want. So here I have the animated sticker effects. And the first thing I wanna do is to drag it right underneath the sectioner. So it's always gonna be a little bit underneath it. So you can see right here. And if I click on one of the stickers right there, you can see first thing I wanna do is actually select an image. In this case, it's an icon. I want to put this little sun because I do think it will look nice. Here we can already see it spinning. We can even attach a link to it. We can tweak around it with size as well. We can decide if it's going to be mobile or not. So here we're going to switch back to desktop. And of course, we can change the position of the whole thing. And this is going to be the most exciting part because I do want to play around with this one a little bit. So the horizontal positioner. It's going to be a little bit more over there because I want to kind of have it over here. And now I want to change the vertical position as well. So I want to have it up there. So this is looking nice. And here we have a bunch of different animation options actually. So we can do a little wiggle. So it's going to wiggle to the side. Here we can set the animation speed. If I set it to 1-1, one, one, it's going to wiggle quite fast. And I'll show you one more. Maybe I'll do the, the fade. So gonna fade in fade out but I want to have let's do the spin actually I think that's the funniest looking one for this one set it a bit slower actually so it doesn't attract too much attention to it and the last thing I want to show you is how I would do it on mobile so here we have it again and here I would just change the vertical positioner because I want to have it in the middle and I want to have a have it overlapping that image right here put it up a little bit more and this is looking good to me. I think we can pretty much save it all up and make it a little bigger on desktop again. And a nice thing about it is that you can add as many as you want. So as you can see right here in the desktop version, I actually added three next to each other. And the thing I did here is just that I kept on adding stickers. So here, if you click on sticker, it just adds another one and it applies like pretty much the same. So you just do the same as you did on that one before and you can get really creative like on that one here, for example. And that's just one section with many stickers in it. Okay, let's have a final look at it in the live version. I don't wanna take up too much of your time. At the end of the day, you wanna customize it to your likings. And here we have it already. Hope you guys found it useful. If you did, always feel free to leave a like and a follow. And with that being said, have a good one and peace out.